Look, I know I have no right to say anything, but Ia, you defended yourself. Just like back in Moonsoul. Right away I saw this guy was a threat to you. I'm I'm not so sure. What I don't understand is who this guy really is. Why were you both in some random cabin in the far woods? Um, this pendant. What is that? I'm sorry, Charles. It's a fragment of Rumlar. Rumlar? As in the Lord of Chaos and Demons? I can't lie. I knew I felt something horrible when I rummaged through that dresser. Charles, is this yours? Did you put Miss Ia through harm's way? Look, I know nothing about this magic stuff. What I want to know is why little Miss Ia over here killed my friend. He, he was the friend who lived here? Don't attack her like that. She was only defending her life from your friend's bad decisions. I met this girl once and then she claimed I kidnapped her when it was me at fault for being the one in this situation. You kidnapped her? Guys, stop! I want to explain so nobody argues. My instinct hasn't let me down. That man was of Rumlar's blood. He came here for one purpose. To hunt me down. To hunt? But, however, I don't think he was the killer. The hunter. So, what's the point you're trying to make? Your friend was with Rumlar. But I think he was just here to roam the village. What does that mean? Ever since Rumlar's reign, he had been positioned he had positioned scouts in every corner of the land, every kingdom and village you can think of. The scouts can come in multiples. Some are in forms of monsters, and some look like humans. They are humans, after all. There is Colt. Alright then, so my childhood best friend, who I almost know everything about, is a demon. Rumlar stands for a mission that if he wins, the lands will be for everyone even the monsters in the dark. Perhaps once he saw me, he took immediate action. No. The hunter is still out there, and now he knows I'm here. Yeah. But then again, why would he want to hunt you? Because I remember... Because I betrayed him. probably waiting for me down here um yeah there he is hey alvar um welcome to my place i guess <laughs> this is where you were staying she lives in the biggest house in scotty ball and she doesn't have an extra room it's a place alvar it's better than outside i mean i could be freezing out there and also i don't have money for a hotel so i mean what do you expect <laughs> sure Alvar, when I said I needed to see Charles, you acted like you knew him. So, do you? Do you remember the carpenter I talked about a while back? It was when you visited my home. Uh, yeah, I remember that. Um, Is that him? It is. I almost forgot he went out here for trades. But didn't you say his name was Albert? It used to be Albert, but he changed his name a while back. I guess I'm more used to saying his old name. Why would he change his name? Albert's a perfectly fine name. It's, it's pretty nice, if I do say so myself. I don't quite remember the reason he did. He doesn't want to talk about it either. Hmm. Yeah, that's, that's fair. You don't have to tell me anything, I mean, with everything happening. Um, that's fair, but are we going to ignore the obvious? I, I killed someone, Alvar. Alvar, I... 
Should I go throw myself in jail again, just like you threw me in when I first came? Your reasoning for now is valid. After all, we're not in Moonsoul. Not the authority over here. As long as Charles doesn't rat us out. I would hate to see you in jail again. <laughs> um, thank you. Um, however, I do think we need to do something. We need to make our own kind of alliance to figure out what's happening. I agree. It's not safe to drag others into this unknown danger. However, now Charles would have to be a part of this. Yeah, yeah, we should go find Charles. You seem to know this village more than I do. I mean, I appeared out of nowhere, like literally out of thin air. So, I mean, you probably know this place way better than me. I wouldn't recommend seeing him right now. After all, you did just confess that his childhood friend is evil. Yep. Um, you're right. <laughs> After everything that happened, I don't know who there is anymore. It almost feels hollow here. I know that feeling. It was something I experienced when I was young and had to go to different villages to live. <sighs> Alvar. Should we go back to Moonsoul? Like, just, just to stay, because everything's happening so quickly and I don't know what to do. Maybe. That cabin... And his friend's house. It made me feel nauseous. Like this, some, this kind of irritating, horrible sickness that I just couldn't, I couldn't deal with it. If we want to get back, we need to head out now. What I know about Scotty Bell is their early curfew. Pack what you have and let's go before the gate closes. Thank you. Um, I don't have much, but I will do that. <laughs> okay. It's getting late. I should... Okay. Oh, Adelina, I'm glad you haven't left yet. Um, I I have to go back to Moon, so I'm um, feeling a bit homesick, you know? Um, so I don't think I'll be able to stay. Oh my, I'm so sorry to hear about that. Homesickness is always so painful to feel. I know, since I left my family back in Brennan Rose. <sighs> yeah, I just... I want to thank you for your hospitality. It means a lot not leaving me on the streets like that and letting me get bullied by those women. It was nice to talk with someone new. It makes me miss the outside wonders. Oh, well, um, maybe sometime you should come to Moonsoul. I'm sure they would be more than happy to have you. It's not a bad idea. We'll see what the future holds. Safe travels, Via. Um, thank you. Um, I'll definitely be back one of these days. This is a lovely village. Um, but adieu for now. Alvar's probably waiting for me already. Um, I hope I'm not too late. And he probably wouldn't leave without me. Oh, no. Okay, you know, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. We'll just pretend everything is okay. Everything, everything is okay. Hi! Um, how are you? What are you two doing at this hour? Um, uh... Merely for a stroll, that's all. Is that right, miss? Yes, walking is what we are doing. Walking, yes, we are doing that. Although we are currently standing, strolling, walking is the action that we are participating in. That is what we are doing. Night shines so bright here. We are mere tourists just wanting to experience that. What was that? Curfew started a few minutes ago. Just make it quick and head back inside. The night opens itself to dangers in the shadows. Thank you, sir. We will wrap it up. We will go back to the house or the hotel that we have a room in. We will go there. Thank you so much, guard. I am so sorry about how that went. Um, but what, what was that about? Nothing we should be concerned about. Let's go through that tunnel. Alright, that doesn't look scary at all. Let's go. That is a good idea. This tunnel is so long. Alvar, are we are we almost there? If we just keep going through here and we'll be on the outskirts of Moonsoul. <sighs> yeah, that's good, but um Alvar. Is it really safe for me? Out there? What do you mean? In Moonsoul, there's no walls, hardly any guards. What, what will happen if I'm found? 
Yeah, we are a village well trained with guards, a literal witch and a strategic strategic duchess. We will do everything in our energy to protect our people, such as you. Hmm. Alvar, what is under your helm? What? I I want to see my savior, Alvar. been here for two days and during that time span I've been grasping at straws what were you thinking well um I went to Scotty ball because um Blair sent me there and then Alvar came to get me Alvar how dare you leave Moonsoul without my word do you have any idea what danger this has put us in if I may correct you Duchess I am NOT the only guard in this village besides I had attended to an important and personal issue more important than Moonsoul the place you have sworn your life to protect? To protect both of us from them? Who? What? We vanquished their troops a long time ago. There have been no signs yet of return. How? You know what? Forget it. Judges, go back to the tower, Alvar. Um, is Cadence going to be okay? Please do not fret. She usually acts out like this when something unexpected like this happens. I'm just glad we made it back in time. But now we must prepare for the worst. We will have to reconvene tomorrow to discuss further plans. Go rest. If you insist. Um, I'll see you tomorrow then, Alvar. Um, sleep well. Um, yep. <laughs> okay. Okay, home, sweet home. I hope Cadence isn't too mad at me. Um, everything looks to be okay. Um, that wasn't here before. Um, a chest. What's this? Lots of words and a lot of scribbles, but I don't, I don't know how to read that. I don't think I can read that. I don't know, um, yeah, um, maybe when I learn to read, I, oh, this is probably private, though. Um, you know, it's fine. It, it's fine. It'll just have gone, mi oh, um, hi, Cadence. I'm sorry if I upset you, um, again, um. What am I doing wrong? What? I try so hard to protect everyone. I thought being their guardian would make up for the lives lost so long ago. Because of me. Because of you? <sighs> Come with me. 